Strawberry plants actually are a fairly hardy plant. They've grown all over the world. These varieties are bred specifically for Ontario. Each strawberry bloom produces one fruit. This is known as a strawberry truss, and this truss came from a strawberry plant, and there's about 10 bloom on each truss. So we'll have 10 strawberries from that plant. And this is where the bees come and do their work. A lot of flavor is due to the amount of sunlight that occurs during the fruiting time. If we have a, lots of sunlight, uh, we tend to have sweeter fruit, uh, higher sugar content. If we get a cloudy year, the berries aren't very sweet. You can't blame the bees for the flavor. It takes a lot of hard work to get these strawberries to the stage they're at now. Uh, they really are a high, high maintenance plant. We plant around 13,000 plants on every acre and each year we plant between 15 and 20 acres of strawberries. We have to keep the weeds out, apply the straw, fertilize them. So uh, everybody loves strawberries but not everybody knows just how much work it really is to grow them. The great challenge for June bearing strawberries of course is you work 49 weeks of the year and then in three weeks you pick that whole crop. My mission statement is to pick them by seven, deliver them to the store or to the market by nine, have the consumer pick them up that same day and have them eating them in the afternoon or the evening. And that's really the best way for June bearing strawberries to get delivered to the consumer. The next two weeks will be our peak for the wholesale business. The pick your own will open. Of course, once that happens, we get a lot more people out on the farm and our farm market gets that much busier. Part of the satisfaction on a day like today is, number one, it's a good crop, but it's also a fun place to be. People are happy, it's a great summer day. It's really satisfying to grow good, healthy food for people. The same field can be harvested several times throughout the season, and so we harvest it in, a, in an organized fashion. So we'll pick this field today, and then we might not come back to it until the day after tomorrow. The Get Fresh Strawberry Festival has really become a big event across Ontario. We're privileged to be one of the farms that hosts festival activities and uh, it's a great way to just celebrate the summer, celebrate great fruit, and we're really glad to be part of it. We can produce as good, if not better, a better tasting product than anybody else in the world. And we don't have to travel nearly as far as all these other products do. So the Buy Local movement is great for the farming community, but it's also great for the consumer. They're getting a fresh product, fresh, nutritious product at a reasonable price.